Hey everyone, my name is Owen, welcome to the video, and today I wanted to say that it takes a victim to make a victim. I've heard this from a channel called Bashar. Another way of saying it is, it takes a wounded person to make another wounded person. It takes someone hurt or sick to, to make someone else hurt or sick. So in my life, in my own personal life, I'm, I rarely... I rarely hurt people, like I never do it actively or deliberately. Um, of course, anyone can spring to any conclusions and imagine anything, so anyone can get, and eventually get hurt. But it's not that they're getting hurt by someone else, but they're getting hurt by their own um, flawed, faulty thinking. So that's the little side shoot of what I'm saying. But generally speaking, it takes someone who's abused to be an abuser. It, so it when we're wounded, we often become a wounder of other people. So that's why it's pivotal to understand this, to help forgive and understand and heal and let go and have compassion or, um, towards other people. Um, and also to stop being abused or mistreated or boundary crossed by another person who is wounded themselves. They ideally, in a, in a more harmonious, idealistic world, they need to get their own healing and heal their own childhood issues, their own wounds, their own pain, traumas. So they stop traumatizing other people and in our own life, you watching this video, also, you may also look, you may also um, look at yourself and, and ask, who are you upsetting or traumatizing in your life? So think about virtues, traits, positive qualities, and think about your own negative behavior, your own negative energy, your own negative. We all react, guys, and that's okay. We all have an emotional reaction. We have a little reaction to people, like you know, you hurting me, I'm gonna hurt you, or whatever the case may be. But part of growing up and becoming more consciously is actually when we, we respond to our reaction in a more careful way. So we all react, but we can choose how we respond to our reaction. And that's where more careful or conscious living happens. So so then let us reflect, question ourselves, reflect, look and, other, look and question and understand situations, relationships, our behaviour, other people's behaviour, and heal ourselves, let go of what's our own issues and heal, look to healers, um, make positive choices in our life, decisions and choices daily, body, physical, mind, spirit, just anything that nurtures us and is good for us and uplifts us, it helps us, to, helps us to heal, helps us to have happiness and joy and helps us to have an open heart and to thrive and prosper in life, physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, every single way. And at the same time, you can, like I said at the beginning of the video, and I'll wrap up this video just to reiterate what I said at the beginning of the video to help elucidate <laughs> what I'm trying to say, which is just like, about, in case you don't know the word, I'm sure you, many of you do, lucid is clear, so to elucidate is to help make something become clearer. You want to have, understand people and relationships and have compassion, but at the same time, you do not want to be a walkover or mis mistreated or abused, so it's, one t it's good to understand people, why they behave, and so... Obviously, they're basically when people are being destructive or mean, like negative, they are to a degree unhealed for sure. And sometimes, or often, you can even say they're sick or sick to a degree, or at least traumatized to a point. Whatever you want to way you want to put it or phrase it, or do they have been a victim or are still acting like a victim without it, maybe even realizing it? So just be careful you don't then become a victim of another person who has been a victim. So protect yourself, guys. Love yourself. Create boundaries, seek space, seek loving support, guidance, uh, nurture, support from other people. And that's all I want to say in this video. So I hope it helped and lots of love. Take care. Thank you for watching and thank you for your time. Feel welcome to subscribe, share, like. Please like as well. Um, leave any comments, share with your friends or family or social media. Um, check it and for spiritual life coaching of body, mind, spirit or to have a look at my herb shop. I have discounts on both of them. Well, for my herb shop is for the first time subscribers, 20% off to try them out. And um, yeah, I also do life coaching as well. So And my books. Okay, well have a great day and thanks again.